If you have this mod installed, these guys will spawn into your world, Dave's. So prepare yourselves. Here we go. Hey. Hey. Oh, he's gonna attack me. Hey guys, Jason here, and welcome to a useless Minecraft mod showcase. Today we're going to be reviewing the most useless mod ever designed for Minecraft. Useless! This mod is by John, and this is John's useless mod, and uh, I mean, it's pretty useless, to say the least. Anyways, let's get started. If you guys enjoy mod showcases and want to see more on my channel, uh, let me know by leaving a like down below. I've been seeing a lot of really cool ones out there lately, and it's been a little bit, so I was thinking about bringing mod showcases back to the channel. But let's go ahead and get started with the mod showcase. Over here, we've got our first chest, and inside this chest is a Spawn Dave the Useless Spawn Egg and a Useless Material. Now, I'm going to show you what Dave is, and I actually have to get a sword because he's pretty crazy. So let's go into Game Mode Zero and spawn him in. He is pretty dangerous. I have no armor on right now, but if you have this mod installed, these guys will spawn into your world. Dave's. So prepare yourselves. Here we go. Hey. Hey. Oh, he's going to attack me. Oh, and he does some pretty hefty damage. Wow, he does like two and a half hearts of damage at a time. <laughs> but when you, whenever you kill him, he, he usually drops a useless material, uh, but sometimes he doesn't. Um, so if you do encounter them in the wild, just uh, kill them, and then they'll drop these useless materials. And then you can use these to craft all sorts of things, which I'm about to get to. So moving on, we've got a few new ores as well. In this mod, we've got uh, a useless ore, a better useless ore, and a legitimate diamond ore. You can find these underground, and they all give you different materials, as you can see. Uh, actually, I should probably get a pickaxe real quick. So I'm going to use my useless pickaxe to mine up some of these. Right here, it looks like we've got the useless material, and that was the useless ore. And then we've got the better useless ore, which I can mine up, and then I get that. Or, say you're mining around and you see this. Well, you're going to think it's a diamond, but guess what? It's not, okay? Because when you mine it, it looks like a diamond and everything. It just says legitimate diamond, but it's not. It's clearly not because, well, this is a real diamond and this is a legitimate diamond. There's a difference. There is a difference, but you can't tell the difference just by looking. So it's pretty disappointing when you're walking around your world and you run into that ore, okay? It's pretty disappointing. But anyways, you can use these useless materials to make some useless tools. And here are the tools here. You can um, j you just pretty much replace uh, whatever material you would normally use to craft a tool with the useless material. So here you can see that we have a uh, couple here to make a sword. And then we've got three for an axe, one for a shovel, and then two for a hoe. And then you got the pickaxe. Um, and then we've got another tool over here, which is... A little more crafty intensive look at this it requires two blocks of diamonds two super useless blocks and remember you can only get super useless material from mining so really that's kind of like this mods diamond it's kind of rare but you need two of those blocks which means you'll need nine because I believe uh, these work like ingots and if I go to game mode one real quick I can just get a stack of these and then I'm going to go hop into a crafting table, which I didn't even put down. So let me put that down real quick. All right, so if we drop those in the crafting table, boom, you can make a super useless block. And that's how you get that. Um, so where were we? We were, at, uh, we were on the multi-tool. Okay, so yeah, you need two of those super useless blocks and then all the tools combined um, to make a useless multi-tool. And this thing is really cool, actually. It can pretty much mine anything as it says right there and it has 10 attack damage which means it is stronger than the useless sword which has nine attack damage so i kind of want to test out the tool let's go over to some of these trees over here and i don't my trees look like they're glitching i don't know if you guys can see that but the leaves are really flashy and it's kind of weird but look how cool this tool is it can mine wood super fast it can dig dirt really fast um, and then it can also mine really fast. Whoa, is there a cave under here? Nice. And then we can go over here. So I don't know what level uh, these ores spawn at, by the way. It could be at a lower level, maybe down by diamond, or it could be up here by the surface. I have no idea. We can kind of explore this cave. Maybe we'll find some. 
Oh, no, we just found a creeper. I'm turning around. <laughs> We're getting out of here. But yeah, the ores do spawn underground uh, naturally for sure. Uh, so let's go ahead and move on to the next chest. After seeing all that, we do have a useless bow and arrow. I forgot to show you. So let's go ahead and shoot those. It's really the same thing as a normal bow. Like, I was testing it around and some mobs took two full critical hits with this um, bow and arrow to kill them so it's probably just about the same as a normal bow it's just crafted like this you got your arrows which has the useless material in the middle and then uh, the sticks are replaced by useless material because everything's useless you know how it goes so let's open up this chest and here we've got useless armor this armor is the most useless armor you could ever make uh, check it out. It's just uh, replaced with useless material, as you can see when you craft it. And, uh, yeah, it's just normal armor. Let's put this stuff on. Let's see if it's even strong. All right, so when you put it on, it <laughs> you kind of look weird. I'm just kind of in a big suit. I don't know what I am. Am I like a dinosaur? Am I in a dino suit? That's so cool. Anyways, it's my armor, and it's apparently really strong. So let's... Uh, Go, go to game mode 1 here, and I, as you can already see, I do have regeneration 10 on uh, at all times. So, Because that regeneration is always just going to charge me back up if I ever lose any health. So if I fall, <laughs> I gained back my health almost instantly. Let's fall from a little higher up. Game mode 0. <laughs> I healed almost instantly. This is some crazy armor. Let's spawn in a Dave and see if he is strong at all. Let's go ahead and hey. let's spawn one of those guys in. There we go. Come on, Dave. Come at me, man. Oh. <laughs> I think I heal instantly. He doesn't even do any damage. Dave, you're no good anymore. <laughs> you're no good. What about some normal zombies? Let's spawn in like three zombies. They can't even damage me. Even They're even setting me on fire. Let's spawn in a bunch of Daves. See if they can take me down. No, they can't. They just can't. My armor's too good. Yeah, I kind of like the armor. It's, I wouldn't say it's easy to make because you do have to kill a lot of these Johns, but it's definitely easier to make than Diamond. And look at the durability. Wow. 16,000 on the chest plate, 15,000 on the pants, 13,000 on the feet, and 11,000 on the helmet. That's pretty intense. Moving on to this chest, we have a few uh, miscellaneous items I wanted to cover. You can make a useless chest because everyone needs one of those. And to make one of those, all you do is put a box like around your crafting table just like this with useless material and you'll get one of those chests. And then if you want to make some useless food, all you have to do is cook it in here. And I actually was cooking a bunch. Uh, but yeah, you just cook it in a furnace and you will get some useless food, which should heal your hunger a little bit. Like three... Three hunger chunks, that's pretty nice. So it does heal your hunger up quite a bit. And then over here we have what we've all been waiting for. This is a useless machine that I have crafted that will take us to a useless dimension. Who's ready for this? I'm ready, because I got some armor on. I'm ready to go to the useless dimension, but first I want to show you how to craft it. So let's go to game mode one real quick and look up this machine. So to craft the useless machine, you need uh, it, just some blocks of quartz in the top left and right corners. Then you got some glowstone dust, some diamonds, a sea lantern, and a couple of those useless blocks in the corner, as well as a redstone block right in the middle, and you will get a useless machine. Um, to use this machine, all you have to do is right-click it. So as you can see, I'm in game mode zero. Just give it a right-click, and I should spawn on an island? Okay, here I am. Yeah, I think I'm actually... Oh, there we go. I just had to turn around. Yeah, it's kind of like the Aether a little bit. I can fly or build my way over to uh, just some sky islands that are generated um, right by where you spawn in. And on these islands, uh, you guessed it, are some Daves. Some useless Daves. Dave, what are you doing over here? What are you doing being so useless? Just walking around, doing nothing but being useless. Come on, Dave. Can't be so useless sometimes. Anyways, once you kill a few of these useless Daves, you can explore the islands. Uh, there's really nothing on these islands. Like I said, everything is useless. I actually think even this grass is useless. No, it's just a grass block. It's tinted differently, though. It's got a different color. Uh, but yeah, there's some pretty neat sky islands. I guess you could live here, but overall, it's useless. 
So that is pretty much it for this mod. I hope you guys did enjoy. Like I said, if you would like to see some more mod showcases on the channel, leave a like down below. Uh, but other than that, I will talk to you stars later. And see you guys.